Financial assets are liquid assets. They're non-physical assets that get their value from a contractual right or ownership claim. As an investor, you can hold a claim on physical assets, such as real estate, or on non-physical assets, such as copyrights, patents, or trademarks. For example, let's say you buy a share of a company and in exchange, that company issues to you a share certificate as a receipt of purchase to reflect ownership. That share certificate is a non-physical asset with a monetary value that can be exchanged or traded with third parties or financial institutions for the value that they hold at the time of maturity. The time of maturity is the time at which investors can redeem accumulated interest on the assets that they hold. It's like a voucher that comes with an expiry date that you must redeem it by. Other examples of non-physical assets are checks, dollar bills, or bonds. Financial assets can easily be converted into cash, traded on the stock exchange market, transferable, or offer returns on investments.